everybody. Hola. <laughs> okay, so the last video you guys saw, we were still at the, actually we were going to the women's RTR and we got there, I made some meatballs <laughs> and now we are at the RTR. We are in the old camp section. We've got a big large area marked off because we have a lot of rigs coming in here, um, our big group. And we're signed fit. in. Make yeah. sure you're signed in. Yes. If you're coming to the RTR and you're not going up to the Bob Wells um, portion and you don't want to sign in up there, there are sign-ups down there, but it's about, what, five miles back? Yeah, it's it's on your way in. Mm -hmm. you'll, you'll see it. You'll see it. And you have to have a permit because the rumor is this today that they are coming around and they are looking for this permit. So don't don't get yourself in trouble if you're coming here and you and uh, you don't want to get a ticket. Anyway, Scotty got a special ride on a razor uh, with our friends Sue and Ed. Yeah, absolutely, a blast. And what did yeah. you do? Where'd you go? We cruised all the way up where the RTR, the Bob's RTR is going to be. We went through the washes. We went up further than you really actually can go um, and filmed it. Lots of fun. It's not that easy of a road to get in and out. We'll see what happens. Um, and we we're allowed to get in there because we we're on a um, ATV, off-road vehicle or whatever, and they can't close it to that. It, it's closed to anybody else going in today um, because it's an event. But since we're in an off-road vehicle, we we're allowed to go through there. So I made a little video about it and uh, hopefully we can show you that. And the funny thing is that there's so many people lined up right before the entrance, ready to go in there. And <laughs> it's gonna get packed. Yeah, it's gonna really, get packed. It's yeah, gonna be, it's and gonna be crazy. But yeah. um, if you're gonna go into the RTR, I think you're gonna have a great time. Absolutely, it's, absolutely. It's just a happy. Everybody's kind of happy, having fun. So, I will put the razor ride um, on after we talk with you guys. Another thing I wanted to talk about is I have a few people leaving comments about the women's RTR. Um, one comment was, um, I'm, you know, that we supported the men's side, you know, them separating the men and, you know, whatever, and they were disappointed in me because I supported that. Well. I have never been to the R the women's RTR. It was an event to go to to see what was going on. Um, Scott and I are adults. It didn't. It wasn't that big of a deal to park on the other side and follow their rules. Yeah. Um, didn't bother me at all. Scott had fun, and I Scotty actually did a video while I was gone into the R women's RTR. <laughs> I came back and he had been playing with the uh, GoPro. So I will post that probably tomorrow. And then, what else? Somebody asked me about the flashlight with the red uh, tape on it. The re there was a joke going around that, that we had to have, if we had flashlights, you had to put a red cover on the, f I threw Which, them away. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> um, I was looking for them. No, I threw them away today. I wasn't going to use them. Um, you had to put this red film on it. They gave you a rubber band to put on the top of your flashlight and the, the rumor joke was that Suzanne couldn't see the stars at night but I went over to the tent and I was I was curious what the reasoning was for that and I was told that um, it was just because it's so dark out there that the lights seem to illuminate a lot more and it just was blinding to people and so um, to keep the ambience of the area they just decided that's what they wanted to do not my rule. I didn't really care because I wasn't. We weren't even in that area, so. Right. And matter of fact, it rained the first, the second night we were there. Correct. Yeah. So we weren't All even outside. All night long. At rain, night rain, time. rain. Yeah. We're not. We're usually Scott and I are not usually out late at night, so it doesn't really matter. And if you've ever seen Scotty's flashlight, which some of you have, it wouldn't blind anybody. <laughs> It's a baby flashlight. <laughs> it's a baby. Whatever. You're like not even I can in the see camera. my feet. I'm here. I'm there. You there. Go. Okay. Um, I don't know. They had a lot of rules there. You know, I, I wasn't in charge of any of that stuff. Um, I think there were over 800 women there, and maybe there was some stuff going on. I stayed out of anything that was going on, and. I think the majority of women had a lot of fun. When I went in there, I saw women having a wonderful time in there, 
just doing their own thing. There were a lot of meetings um, set up in rows of like a 1 through 30, I think it was. Um, and that's it. I didn't go to any of the meetings. Me either. I went to one. <laughs> I avoided I went, everything. I went to one meeting where a gal was cooking bread on a um, on a, a Coleman stove, and it was a recipe that you could do that so that if you didn't have an oven and an RV that you could make actual bread. Um, that was great because Dana got that recipe because she doesn't have an oven in her RV and so that's that was really great. There were massage classes, there were aerobics going on and art classes, all kinds of stuff for women to go to. Um, will we go next year? Probably not. Not because of any rules or anything that happened. I, I wasn't affected by anything so um, and I just try to stay out of all of that craziness. Um, Scotty didn't want. I didn't worry to, about it. Yeah. Scotty didn't want to have to no. make another drama video. No. <laughs> I just went up. It was neat to go walk up a wash and and do the metal detector. Which probably not the right. Guys. Yeah, probably not the right place to go. Um, simply because it's just more sand or whatever. But I felt safe. So well, you were yeah. learning. So I am. I'm good. still learning. Yeah. yeah. So I'll show you guys that in a video tomorrow or. I'll show you guys that. I kind of wanted to get you caught up with where we were because we have some people that want to come meet us. I have actually some comments that said, are you guys at RTR yet? Yes, we are here. And we are in the part, part, what is it called? Parte. <laughs> part, part. Part RTR or something like Part that. Part RTR. Yeah. Um, it's a sign when you're coming up the road, It you'll see it. It says um, P-A-R-T-R. Yeah. Part -A -R. Yeah. Part -A R. And they have a main camp down below. Now, that main camp has nothing to do with us. We had already planned on being in this um, area to begin with. So, I don't know what they're doing down there or how they have it set up. We just knew that we were coming probably to this area and then maybe go into the RTR. But when Scotty got back, he's like, no, we, it's, it's. Crazy. I'm not driving in there no. personally. And so, it's, but yeah. that's, we so, have plenty of cars to get us in there. And actually Ed has the ATV, uh, the Razor, and that's the way to go. Okay. Yeah. I want me one. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to go <laughs> no. play with it now. Yeah. Um, we invited you guys, whoever is coming, if you want to come and visit us, we've already had quite a few visitors today. Um, if you want to visit us, if you want to come and camp in the surrounding area, we have, we have our um, blocks set down kind of in a row because we have about, like I think I said at the beginning of the video, we have about seven more huge rigs coming in here. So we need this area here, but you are more than welcome to park camp on the outer part of that area. Lots of room out there, guys. And yeah, we would absolutely. love to have you guys come on over. Um, you got to bring a chair. We only have four chairs. And, and there's only two of us. Yeah. <laughs> so, so somehow we have four chairs and two but of us. But please, I, I read a comment last night, I think it was, and, and I can't, I'm sorry, I can't remember the, the name of, it, of the person. Um, she said that she had seen us at the van build, and she thought we were busy, and she didn't want to intrude. Please, you guys, if, if you guys weren't out there, we wouldn't have a channel. We want to meet you. We don't forget where we come from. We once watched, I used to watch YouTube, so I don't forget that. So please, absolutely, don't be embarrassed. Don't be afraid. Um, don't feel like you're intruding. Like I said, though, if the door's shut, maybe don't knock. We do get a lot of that, but we're if if our door's shut, it's because we're doing something in here. Working. <laughs> Working. Working. Um, but please feel comfortable to come and say hello to us. We are very friendly, open, and we want to meet you guys. We want to meet who's on the other side of the camera. Absolutely. Yeah. All right. I think that's it. Um, Until tomorrow. Yeah. That's Love you guys. Appreciate everything you do for us. And keep watching. Oh. Oh, see. I said something wrong, and now the GoPro wants to start filming. The GoPro just came on. <laughs> I don't know what you said. I don't know what I said. All right. Like Scotty was saying. Until another day. Yeah. We love, love you Love you. Thank you so Enjoy much. Enjoy the RTR with us if you can't come out here. I hope that we give you guys enough to, to uh, enjoy it. We love you. All right, everybody.
friend Mr. Ed here is going to give me a ride so I can register in his razor. Hang on! Good. All right, so Ed brought me out here to uh, the first wash. Where are you going to go to the RTR? Lots of people out here. Okay. We can drive. How's it going? Hey, Scotty. Yeah. He said we can go down in here because we have an ATV. ATVs only are allowed in Yay! here. So let's go. <laughs> All right. Ed and I are going to cruise down through the wash. We're going to check out where the RTR is going to be. Look at all these people here. They are just packing in here. I'm going to hop back in the razor and let's go check it out.
get to the music camp, everybody. Sixth Street? I don't know how many people are going past there. <laughs> oh, somebody's going to end up in that right there. Somebody's going to end up turning yeah. into that. And th that's going to be the end of this road. Somebody's yeah. going to put a wheel right there. They cannot go any further back here unless you have one of these awesome rigs like this. Wow, this is crazy. <laughs> And hopefully this is not the emergency exit. <laughs> I think it is. <laughs> this is turning into like a real 4x4 trail. Yeah, I know. Is that the end of it then? It must be. There's no way they can expect people to come back. No, here. no. This has got to be all ATV stuff. This is nuts. We'll ask them up here before we turn around. If Yep. I don't know, man. Maybe it starts to open up. They're going to be like, we've been hiking forever. Are we in California? <laughs> Hopefully people are coming back this far to camp. <laughs> are, we, are we camping back this far? Um, I'm, yeah, we're, we're going for... Yeah, but they're, they're, they're saying that tomorrow people can come back this far. Oh, yeah, no. They're going to expect campers to come back this far, maybe? I don't know. We're, we're trying to figure that out. We walked quite a ways down there. There's there. signs. I mean, walking all this way, the RTR sign, so... It ends, I, I would say, where that 6th Street sign yeah, is. Yeah, that's the line. I, I would say, you know, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a 4x4, four four, you know, truck, and I would... Just, like this would be as far as I'd go, but with it. Yeah, it's yeah, crazy. Like, how do they expect people to get back here? I don't know. I'm saying back there it ended. Or Did whatever. you see where that one where it turns sharp in the wash and then there's that big yes. ditch right there? So yes. somebody's gonna go straight and put a wheel in that and that's gonna be big stuck yeah. without a record. So yeah, then we, you gotta get a record past everybody yeah. all yeah. the way in. We were talking about that. We we're like one person gets stuck and everybody else is yeah, so we're gonna talk about how many how many people get stuck. Yeah. <laughs> We should, no, actually, we're, we're staying back there in old camp and everything yeah. like that. We need that. some bleachers yeah. for the peanut gallery. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, ladies, have a wonderful night. Yeah, thank you. See you later. Bye. Yeah, this, this is, is crazy, yeah. Scott. <laughs> this is definitely uh, back roads to wherever. I mean, this is pretty rough to even turn this thing around. Oh, yeah. I think Chuck came back here with his um, rig well, and, and brought Carolyn back here. Yeah, there's a bunch of trails that go yeah, up the hills exactly. Down here. Exactly. You can see, Ed and I came all the way out. Definitely no RVs are coming out this far, unless you have four-wheel drive truck and a camper, or you're really just a little crazy. Beautiful area. The RTR area ends up there. That third wash is insane. Actually, I find that the second one's pretty pushing it too. We'll take a ride back, and you guys can judge for yourself. And thank you so much, Ed, for giving me a ride in this thing. It's so much fun. Let's, let's check it out on the way back. But look, it's, it yeah. is worse this way. Yeah. Look. That is terrible. I mean, you can almost hit your bumper on this. Oh, yeah. That is... <laughs> that's crazy. I think that's why the music section's out this way. Well, this does go down a long way.
different this way. Yeah. That's a bit of a hill right there. Yeah, that is. That's where you want to make sure your groceries are all... Ah! Oh my god! Oh, look down. And look at them. Hey, let's pull over here for a minute. Okay, so Ed and I stopped for a little bit and you can see the people filing in. And they're coming all the way to this point. And maybe they're waiting until they open up the road to go back that way. Look, Scott, they're parking uh, in the line right there. like So, like, you know, that would be the first dude in. Yeah. Look at that. I think they're lining up. But I'm telling you what, that ain't a bad wash if you have a regular rig. Obviously she must be part of the whole staff only thing. So, I guess if you hit it at 10 miles an hour in a van, it's not too bad. <laughs> My bumper would drag, no, no question. So, I think it's all doable. But what I understand is if you had, and granted it's a wash, if you had all that rock right there where it says, welcome to RTR, why wouldn't you just kind of fill it in a little bit? I don't know. But not for me to do. It's beautiful out here. God bless and good luck to the people going back there. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy! But that's the way it is.